Hey guys, Jake here with Success Motors. I have another Ford excursion for you guys to check out. Uh, more than likely you are on this video because you saw the link on the advertisement. Uh, just as a reminder, this channel is for us to upload videos of the vehicles that we have in because we have a lot of people who are buying from up north and they just want to see a video of the vehicle before they put a deposit down or before they spend the money to fly down so anyway i'm going to detail over the next 10 to 12 minutes everything about this vehicle i'll tell you all the flaws i'll tell you the history of it everything that i know about it and then we'll kind of go from there and again my name is jake uh, the channel is Success Motors. That's the name of our dealership. We're down here in College Station, Texas, and we sell uh, pretty much exclusively specialty vehicles, Dodge Vipers, Raptors, Ford Excursions. And we've kind of landed on the Excursion as something we sell a lot of. So stay tuned for the channel. I add a pretty much Excursion to the fleet weekly. So I'm going to try to keep videos coming at you uh, probably once a week or more and uh, just detailing what we have in stock so without further ado this one here is a 2005 ford excursion limited unlimited so it is the highest trim level that you could get it is loaded then if i'm just being honest guys this is one of the nicest nicest excursions i've ever seen it is in really really good condition now obviously it's not perfect because how could it be it's almost 20 years old it's 18 years old but it's very very nice it's obvious that whoever owned it prior took very good care of it. It looks like it was garage kept its entire life. The paint is in really good shape. The video is not lying to you. Uh, the paint is in really good shape. It has not had a paint correction or anything like that. This is just a, a wash uh, and a wax and it looks phenomenal. There are maybe, maybe two door dings um, on the vehicle and that's about the only flaws from a bodywork perspective. It's extremely nice. Again, this is a four wheel drive. It is a six liter power stroke diesel. I'll tell you right off the bat, this one has not been bulletproofed. I'll repeat that again. This one has not been bulletproof. So it has not been studded. It has not been deleted. If that's something that you would wanna do, or if that's what you're looking for, just keep that in mind. But again, this is one of the nicest excursions that I have ever seen. I think the beauty of this vehicle and the condition makes up for the fact that it hasn't been um, deleted yet. So it's completely stock. As far as I know, um, the only thing that it has on it from a, there's no tune on it or anything right now. Um, and it has a, a, a trailer brake controller. Well, let's kind of go through the aftermarket part. So clearly it's got a four inch lift and level. It does have a trailer brake controller, and then it does have ride right airbags in the rear. And then it has a backup camera. But other than that, it is stock. The engine is stock. Again, it hasn't been studded or deleted, so you might want to do that. But it is a absolutely beautiful truck. So I'm just going to go through here and document uh, everything, get a little closer to it so you can see how clean it is. Worth noting... The little piece right here uh, is broken, doesn't affect it, the light still works, but it's cracked like perhaps the previous owner hit something. And then you can see here, little door ding right there and little door ding right there. And I'm telling you, that's probably the only two flaws on this side of the truck. It's very, very clean, really, really good condition. Little scratch right there on the bumper. very good it does have a light scratch right here this is in the clear coat not a dent could totally be buffed out looks like the previous owner just might have hit something so a little scratch that's in the paint on this plastic piece but right here could totally be buffed out otherwise not a single dent on this side really really good shape hoods in good shape i think it has one or two just little dents right here not sure like one two not hail damage because there's only two of them. It's in really, really good shape. It's a Texas truck. It's been in Texas his entire life. So no rust. I'm going to show you guys the interior of it right quick. No rust. You can see the rockers are really clean. The leather interior is very nice. Everything works, you guys. If you know excursions, you know this one's in a good shape. It's got the memory seats. It's got the heated seats. And it doesn't even have a, a steering wheel cover because the steering wheel is not all ragged out. Like 99% of them have steering wheel covers. 
because the steering wheel is disgusting. Everything stock, you see the trailer brake controller right there. All that, the vents. Boom, really good shape, guys. Again, I think this is probably one of the cleanest excursions that I've ever seen. I'll start it up here in a few minutes so you guys can hear it, and I'll show you underneath the engine as well, but just kind of documenting the condition. Seats are in good shape. It's got the TV, TV uh, works, rear AC works, AC blows cold. Headliner is clean. Back seat is good. Open up back here so you guys can check it out. Spare tire with spare tire cover. A uh, couple of little stains back there. Previous owner had kids, so that looks like, like a marker or something. Coming around to this side. Again, guys, 2005 Ford Excursion. Limited, unlimited. Six liter power stroke diesel. Four wheel drive. Just clean. Clean, 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 clean. Video's not lying to you. Sometimes the video makes these things look better than they are. That's not the case on this one. It's really nice. I think you'd get here and you wouldn't be disappointed. Oh, again, rockers. No rust. Dash. Really clean. Has the original owner's manual. Beautiful truck. Oh, I will document. This is broken here. It just needs to be maybe glued back on. That is broken right there. All right, cool. I'm going to pop the hood, you guys, so you can hear it run. And you can see just how clean this engine bay is. Again, like I mentioned, um, it's pretty much stock other than the lift. Um, I do believe that the brake lines have been replaced. Hold on just a second. Sorry for that. It takes both hands to open the hood. Boom, show you the engine. Engine is super clean. Engine bay is super clean. But again, as you can, you might not be able to see down there, but it has not been studded. But engine is very clean. Would make a great candidate to be studded. Really nice truck. Really, really nice truck. Let me start this thing up so you guys can hear it run. Not a cold start. Starts right up. Radio works. Windows work. Door locks work. If you guys hear it run. Again, guys, this thing is a, I believe it's a three owner. Uh, it's a Texas truck. It's been in Texas its entire life. Just to give you a little backstory of what I know about it. It has an interesting history, all right? So I actually picked this thing up. This guy hit an auction back in April. And it was, it was um, picked up by a small dealer in Houston, Texas. And I found it, went and looked at it. And, and bought it. I was able to actually reach out to the previous owner. Um, I was just able to find his information and I was able to get some information from him. It was a family guy. He owned it and he used it to take his family on vacation. He had a couple of kids. I think he said he had five kids. And anyway, so that's the history. I got it just a few weeks back out of Houston. Now here's kind of an interesting thing, all right? So you gotta see past this. You'll, you'll see that the odometer shows 182,000 miles on it. However, the Carfax, the Carfax is phenomenal. It was in the Ford dealership getting its oil changed every 5,000 miles, okay? However, because of that, we're able to see that the last odometer reading at the end of April was 292, 292,000. So you remember I mentioned that small dealership that got a hold of it in Houston? 
I can't say this with certainty because I know it has legal ramifications, so I'm not going to accuse them necessarily, but I am pretty sure that the dealership that I basically picked it up from, I'm pretty sure they rolled the odometer back. They only had the truck for like a week. And because of its age, it's exempt. So it'd be an easy one to do, and without a Carfax report, you wouldn't know it. But again, the Carfax shows that it had its oil changed or service done on like April the 30th of 2023, and it had 292,000 miles on it at that time. And now the odometer shows 182. So uh, there was, I think, foul play in the odometer reporting. It was not done by me, but I would hate for you to buy it thinking it has 182 when I feel pretty confident by the Carfax report that it's 292. So keep that in mind. But again, you guys, one of the cleanest excursions I've ever seen. The price reflects the fact that it hasn't been deleted um, and it has that odometer discrepancy. But otherwise, this is one of the nicest excursions I've ever seen and I think it would be an incredible vehicle. It'd be a great candidate to go out, spend five grand, get it studded, get it deleted, and then keep it forever. You're not gonna find one with a cleaner body. You're not gonna find one that's been taken care of better. The interior is phenomenal. Again, Success Motors, you guys, if you have any questions, feel free to email me, info success, at successmotors.net. You can find us on Facebook. You can find us on Instagram, Success Motors. You can give us a call, 979-202-1948. 979-202-1948. All right, God bless you guys. Stay tuned.